Hello YouTube, my name is Nick, and today I have episode 4 of my Gun of the Day series using the 4th assault rifle that you unlock, the Tar 21. The attachment I'm using is the Silencer, my secondary is the Spaz 12, perks are Scavenger, Stopping Power, Ninja, you got Claymore, Stuns, and I'm using a Predator Harrier Chopper Gunner Killstreak setup. I'm going to start off by talking about my or about the stats on this gun. Um, the TAR does a maximum damage of 40 and a minimum damage of 30, making it kill in 2 bullets close range and 3 bullets long range using stopping power. Um, uh, my perks are scavenger, because um, I just enjoy using scavenger on this gun. Uh, sleight of hand is a good choice too, but uh, I, I like running around and I get a lot of um, high kill streaks using this gun. <laughs> As you can see, this gun uh, has a really high fire rate and high damage, which makes it very effective for hip firing and close range. You can run around corners really easily with it and uh, not have to be afraid of anyone you know, um, around that corner. As long as they're not waiting with a shotgun, you're usually going to kill them with your tar. Um, the second perk I'm using is stopping power. You can use different uh, second perks on this gun, but stopping power is just what I prefer because I like killing quickly. You know, none of the other perks really are that important to me. Um, cold blooded it seems like it takes a long time when I when I don't use stopping power to kill with this gun, just because I'm so used to using stopping power with it. Uh, the kill streak setup I'm using right now is not the, uh, the kill streak setup I would be using on high rise. Uh, if you know, if you uh, didn't notice, I joined this game. A little bit late. I think the game was like 10 kills in when I joined, uh, so I didn't know what this lobby was before. So I just had my standard uh, kill streak setup on with my really high kill streaks and whatnot. So uh, if I had seen this game in the pre-game lobby, uh, I would have switched my kill streak setup to the UAV carrier Pavlo. Uh, there's a couple of reasons for that. Uh, this map's kind of small and people can get to you quite quickly. So I find that whenever I spend time calling in a Predator Missile, I usually just get killed while doing it. Uh, I find that with UAV, uh, that takes like a second to use. I call it in, I know where somebody is, and I can kill them quite quickly. Uh, I don't really have any trouble getting gun kills on this map. And uh, the Harrier, just because that's a default overpowered awesome seven kill streak and the pavlo goes um when you get the chopper gunner they tend to just sit in the back of their spawn and not come out and there's not a whole lot you can do with it it just feels like it's a waste of a minute and a half like i could be getting more kills if i was just using my gun than if i were in the chopper so the pavlo just takes care of anybody who uh gets out of the building and you kill all those people in the building with your gun so i find that uh Pavlo is a much better option than the chopper gunner on this map. Uh, yeah. So, the attachments for the TAR. Uh, my favorite attachment is the silencer. I find that uh, it reduces the recoil and makes it a lot more usable. Uh, the TAR is extremely powerful and has a really fast fire rate, uh, making it one of the best guns in the game, in my opinion. So, um, the, only def er, the only downfall to the uh, the tar is that it has a lot of recoil so if you want to get around that uh, adding the silencer helps a lot if not uh, I recommend the red no sorry not the red dot not using the red dot but using the holographic I'm not a fan of the holographic usually but uh, since the tar has its special red dot site where it looks kind of ugly and whatnot um, I tend to use the holographic if I want to sight uh, but I find its iron sights aren't too difficult to use, so FMJ or Excited Mags is also a good option if you're looking for an unsilenced gun. And, um, yeah. So my favorite attachment is the silencer. Uh, when I use the tar, I tend to kind of sneak up behind people. I like that it can get, you know, three or four kills per clip if you use it properly. You can shoot people long range if you shoot slowly. Uh, close range, you can kill people with the hip fire. So it's a very uh, versatile gun. It's quite effective. Um, as you can see, it's a little bit hard on the long range there, but uh, you can you can take people out fairly quickly. And uh, it doesn't run out of ammo too fast. 
but I uh, still like using Scavenger because, as I said before, I like to get high streaks. And uh, yeah, using Predator wasn't a good choice this game. <laughs> I don't get any kills with it and uh, just kind of like wastes my time. Maps I use this gun on, I like High Rise, any ma silence map, or any map where you want to use a silence gun. I recommend Storm, Overgrown, Underpass, Rainy Maps, Maps with Bushes, whatever. And uh, yeah, so <laughs> that's the end of the game. Final score was 31 and 3. Please like the video and subscribe if you'd like to see more. I'll see you guys later. Bye.